Welcome to Let's Play Solitaire, and thanks for watching. Today we're going to tackle a random game. If you'd like to see more of these, there's a playlist in the channel called Let's Play Solitaire. There's also some uh, Solitaire tips and a different playlist in this channel as well. Let's go ahead and get started here. First things first, I like to see what columns can be moved. It looks like there's two twos here. We're going to try this two first and then pull it back. If it doesn't work out. Oh, we can move both two, so it's not going to matter. Ace of hearts there, two of hearts. And, of course, the three of hearts. We're going to get lucky and be able to move the queen as well. And it looks like we can move this eight as well. And the four hearts can be moved. Oh, nice. Wow, we're just getting a lot of moves here. I'm not used to seeing this many cards being able to move. And we haven't even got to the draw pile yet. So, interesting. I uh, still got to figure out a way to get a column or two opened and get the rest of these cards out of the way. There's the jack right there. Oh, don't want to fall for the trap. Try to save the first card if you can. Uh, that'd be the jack. Try to save this first card as insurance because there's just like 21 more cards in the draw pile. 24 cards total. Let's see if there's any moves here. Nothing. There's a king we'd like to move, but we have to open up a column to do that. Ace of clubs we can move. And again, another king. Hmm. We can move this five, I believe. Okay, nothing else there. Oh, wait. Eh, this is going to be interesting. The good news is this first card we can move... And we can move some other cards with that, but we're going to have to figure out what we want to play exactly. Again, there's two fours here, so I'm holding off on moving this four. We're going to see if there's anything else out here. No, I don't believe there is. Okay, so let's go back. And uh, let's see, what cards do we want to move? We'd like to move this Ace of Diamonds, probably. That would be a good card for us. So what we're going to do is we are going to move, well, let's see. We can only move one card, actually. We need to move two cards to get to the Ace of Diamonds. Oh, no, I take it back. Here's the two cards. One and number two, but I think we're going to want this three of clubs in the front, probably. And now, let me see what I want in the front. I, we're going to want to get to the three of diamonds at some point. I think what we're going to do is play this four. And then we still have the option on the three. We can pull this four down and then bring that three of clubs down. So I, I hopefully made some sense there. What I'm looking to do, in short, is get this ace of diamonds up. Oh, we already have it, I guess. There's a ten. Now we can move this nine, so that's good. Now we've got an open slot, so that's real good. We'll move the Ace of Diamonds there. Six and five. And then, oh, we get the Ace of Spades. That's real good. We've got two uh, columns open, so that's we're looking good here. Let's move the King. Move the three of clubs, four of clubs. And uh, we can move these cards out of the way, I believe. Probably playing too fast, but we might be able to get away with it here. So let's see. Generally speaking, you don't want to play this fast and play all the cards in sequence like I was doing right there. But I think we're going to get away with it. This is one of the few games you can get away with it. It looks like... Yeah, this is going to be one of the few games... If I played every game like this, my solve rate would be really low. And it might actually... I might actually get in trouble here. That Seven of Diamonds needs to be pulled. So... We're going to undo some moves here. The Seven of Diamonds needs to be pulled so we can move the Six underneath it. So we're going to back up here. One, two. Okay. I'm going to leave those cards there. The reason why... The next card, when we reset the draw pile, is going to be the Seven right here. And we need that card. So, And then we can play all the other cards that we wanted to as well. So here we go. Seven of Diamonds right there. Now we move the Six... And I think we've almost got this here. So two of spades, there's a nine. 
again playing a little too fast. I think we need to do this eight down. So let's back up a little bit here. We're going to need those two cards out, and then this eight should show up. There's the eight. Now we play that. Now we can move the seven. Okay. That's what we wanted. Two of spades, nine. And we'll get this thing uh, solved in just a minute here. Just going to bring up as many of these cards as we can. Let's go diamonds up to the foundation pile. There's clubs. Now let's do spades up to the foundation pile. We'll do hearts. And then back to diamonds. And eventually this nine of diamonds is going up. Let's see, spades, eight. Move the seven here, eight of diamonds up. Nine of diamonds up. And uh, we solve it right there. So that, that is one of the rare fast games. Again though, you gotta be careful with the draw pile. Otherwise you can get into trouble. So I played a little fast with the draw pile, got away with it there. But if you do that more often than not, it's going to cost you. Uh, and again, uh, if you need more tips and stuff, I would highly recommend checking out the uh, playlist in this channel called Solitaire Tips. For more games, more complicated games it is, uh, definitely take a look at uh, Let's Play Solitaire, the playlist on this channel with a bunch more games. Anyway, uh, thank you for watching and